All right, knocked out that 16 hour shift and I'm still just frustrated from, it all seems to be falling apart right now, but uh, it's still gonna get there. We're still grinding, we're still hustling. It's just back to what I was talking about. Like I made a decision, like all the stress and agony and turmoil and just everything's going on and things just aren't going right. And, but nothing great comes without a lot of stress. Nothing great come easy, but at the same time, I could get rid of it all. I could not do an expansion. I could just live an average lifestyle and get rid of all the stress and issues that I'm going through. But it's not what truly makes me happy. You're gonna find on the other side of the most stressful, beat up, no path road to your destination and your C9 life, it's gonna be the hardest you've ever been through. But on the other side is the tiniest sliver of an island for every single person that is filled with the abundance of everything you could ever dream of. Like, you gotta get there. It is small, and but it is a long, long journey. But that's all it takes. All we are is missing that one little piece in our life to bring that absolute happiness. There's just one tiny little sliver I absolutely believe in that everybody is missing that will bring the happiness to infinity. But the road is long, and too many of you guys give up. There's exits along the whole way. There's express lanes to average. I made a decision. I stick with it, and it's gonna come at all costs, no matter what. Sometimes my sanity feels like it's in the mix of it, but at the end of the day, if I never tried, that would be the ultimate regret. I mean, what do I really honestly have to complain about? Majority of us are doing better than most of the world. Just because something isn't going our way, we're going to start complaining about stuff. No, at the end of the day, I'm doing damn well and I'm very successful for uh, my age or let alone amongst people so that's where I stay humble and that's where I stay grateful I'm here I'm living a great life but to me it's not a C9 life so I gotta keep chasing it I gotta keep hustling I gotta keep grinding I gotta just I love the journey no matter how stressed out people everybody thinks it is I work better under pressure the more pressure I have the more chaos it seems to have the more I love it. It's like organized chaos. If I wasn't constantly hitting hurdles and issues and problems, I wouldn't be happy. I would literally probably try to start something else up. I would try to find other issues and other problems to solve. It's just who I am. By becoming self-aware of who I am and what I need, that's exactly what everybody needs to do and find out. Because at the end of the day, when I know exactly that's what I need and I can always revert to that no matter how stressful things get. Alright, after that 16 hour day, I gotta get in and get to bed. I'm exhausted, I'm tired. And I got a long day of figuring out some problems ahead of me. I got big changes and decisions I gotta make, but make a decision, move forward from it and don't dwell on it. See you in a bit. Okay, definitely busy night, day at the gym here. Um, I did a lot of paperwork, a lot of stuff here. I had to make the final decision and uh, I did set up, made, um, made a new LLC today. So work 3 p.m. to 7 a.m., slept from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m., got up, went and saw that I got my new title and my mail for my truck, so I went and registered that, came to the office, paid my Light my registration for this year. Got, I set up the new LLC. It'll be for the new facility, will be Need Fitness LLC. Will be for the new place. Need Fitness, N E E D Fitness LLC. 
but we also have our Iron Outcast in the back in the hardcore room so we can still keep that going. So I got a new LLC set up today. I did a new fiend number, which is my federal tax identification number, my sales tax identification number. Um, yeah, so pretty much set up a whole business while in the office here today doing that paperwork. Then I filed my sales tax for my quarterly that I have to do with my business. And then I went out and did some extensive cleaning in the whole gym, got my leaf blower out and blew out the whole gym. It looks a hell of a lot better. But as we can see, it's 10 15. I don't really ever get out of here before 8 p.m. like I used to. I used to leave at 8. But it's all just putting in part of the journey, part of the process. Things will only get busier. So we finished up loading video from Tuesday. We got that done. Uh, got to head to work, 11 p.m. to 11 a.m. Got to get after. I mean, what'd you do today? What did you What did you really accomplish? I set up a whole other LLC, and did a lot of paperwork, and registered vehicles, and slept after working 16 hours. So I don't really care to hear anybody's excuses. Just put in the work, check your mind off, and just do what needs to be done. Bye.